at the end line. What does he have left in the tank? A massive serve results in an overpass. Chance for Milano, Losser, but he gets dug. Ball's still alive, but Trentino can't get it over. And now Milano is down by just one. What a serve from Ishikawa, blasting it off Lorenzano. What does he do this time now? Better ball in. Spertoli goes to Michieletto and Alessandro Michieletto from the back row scoring again. Point number 21 for him. The danger of not serving him means he's open on the attack pattern that time. Coming out of the back row, timed nicely. The connection with Spertoli leads to the point. Trentino back up by two. Eleven serving nine for Kozamernik. Good pass from Melgarejo and Loser gets dug. What a dig! But that set goes over. And then a net violation against Rick Litsky on the block. Milano able to steal that point. After an amazing dig by Spiritoli, Trentino not able to control it. So it's 10 serving 11 for Losir. And it's 11-all, a service winner for the Argentinian middle blocker. Finds this. Loser goes at Riklitsky this time. Nagalini gets dug by Ishikawa. Melgarejo will get a chance, and he is stopped at the net. Another massive block by Trentino that time. Their blocking has come alive in the later stages of this match. It was Magalini coming across as the third blocker. Getting that block point on Melgarejo. Their 14th block point of the match for Trento. Now 12-11 for Rick Litsky. His serve goes at Ishikawa. Poro on the run. Goes overhead to Reggers. And he can't... Find the floor, Magalini tries to go under the block, but he hit it out of bounds. Tough situation there for Giulio Magalini against the triple block. Tried to hit the extreme angle on this swing, but catches the net and it goes out of bounds. 12 all now for Ferre Reggers. Goes off speed at Michieletto. Magalini again off the net, and again it goes out of bounds. So it's back-to-back -back errors leading to a one-point advantage now for Milano. in the front row you have to think they'll go to Michieletto or Riklitsky out of the back row for the attack here and they go to Magalini and he goes down the line off the block of Poro so Spiritoli showing some faith in his outside hitter that time as he scores the point and we're tied up at 13 all That serve catches the cable, slows it down for Catania. Melgarejo, what a save from Lorenzano, though. And now Michieletto off the hands. Catania touches it. Ishikawa goes crashing into the banners. And the point will go to Trentino. What an effort there from Milano's defense, but they weren't able to bring it back. And now Milano calls a timeout 
as it'll be. With Magalini to serve. Poro on the run, goes to Melgarejo. Good deflection. Rick Litsky keeps it alive. Magalini will swing from right back and he hammers that ball into the net. He was the only hitter available, made a good approach. But the attack finds the net and we're tied at 14 all. And Piano will come in to block for Ishikawa. With Melgarejo serving, Coach Piazza trying to strengthen their block by adding Piano to the front line. Good pass from Lorenzano. Goes to Rick Litsky, and Rick Litsky scoring from the back row that time, finding the ball through off of Poro's block. So Milano continuing to roll the dice with their block and defense. Ishikawa will come back in. And it'll be match point number two now for Trentino. To her at the in line. He misses that one long. So an overtime fifth set. Deuce game tied at 15 all. First one, two points clear, we'll take it. Here's Vitelli. Goes to Lorenzano. Mickey Aletto pushes it through, and Mickey Aletto will take that point. As that set was a little tight, Mickey Aletto goes up to Joust and pushes it through the Poro block. So now match point opportunity number three for Trentino. Short serve. Poro on the run. Goes to Ishikawa. Gets the triple block. It doesn't matter. And Yuki delivers. 16 all now. Piazza shouting in position players where he wants them to be, but that serve travels long. Poro with the miss, and Trentino stays at match point now. It'll be opportunity number four for Mickey Aletto. The most important serve of the match for him, and he goes long. He went aggressive. Trentino thinks maybe it might have grazed Milgarejo. No challenge coming in. So we'll play on. 17 all on the scoreboard. Ishikawa now at the end line. His aggressive serve in Magalini. High pass through the middle. Kozumernik scores. And then Spiritoli goes straight over to Magalini with the approval of that pass. It was a good read from Losaire up in the air, trying to take away the wrist away, but Kozumernik finds it. He'll rotate into the back row now to serve. Match point number five for Trentino. Into the net from Kozumernik for a miss. So a free side out given to Milano. 18 all on the scoreboard now for Losaire. He goes aggressive in Magalini. From off the net, Rick Litsky into the block and down on Milano's side. Rick Litsky will rotate into the service position. 
Well, Mel Guerrejo was there, had two hands on it, but just drifted past the antenna. Match point number six now. Can Trentino do it on this one? They cannot as that serve finds the net. Back-to-back -back service errors for Trentino at match point and we play on. 19 all. Reggers at the inline. A dangerous server for Milano. Goes off speed at Magalini. To her. Deflected. Chance for Milano now. Ishikawa finds a way through and Ishikawa scores. Milano takes the lead. What a deflection by the blockers of Milano leads to Ishikawa and his favorite shot from the back row. The wrist away back to zone five, scoring their 20th point. And now Milano is in front with their first chance at match point. Here's Reggers. Off speed again at Mikioletto. Rick Litsky. Oh, what a dig from Catania. Sends him to his backside, but it comes over. Rick Litsky again, this time cross court for the winner. Rick Litsky not holding anything back. Crushing that ball. Two chances from the back row. Here's the second one that found the floor going through the angle seam. Tied again. Nelly comes into the front row as a blocking substitution for Trentino. Replacing Spertoli, so no center on the floor for Trento. Magalini to serve. He misses long again. It's three straight service errors for Trentino. And now Milano, their second chance for match point. It's Melgarejo at the end line. 13 points on the night for him. Looking for his second service ace. But Michieletto passes it well. Rick Litsky is stopped at the net for a block point. Milano has done it. They take the match. 22-20 in the fifth. And they level this series at one match apiece. The streamers are falling, but a video check request has come in from Trentino. Let's take a look at the replay now. It was a good ball in for Michieletto. Rick Litsky gets blocked by Paolo Poro at the net. So Coach Soli probably challenging a net touch on the block of Milano. Trentino had their chances. They missed three serves at match point. And if Paolo Poro is clean on this block, this match is over. And it is confirmed. No touch. That will do it. Milano winning this battle against Itas Trentino in five sets at home in this third place playoff. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and make sure to subscribe to Power Volleyball for more volleyball videos.